So this is Echo Crag, this is uh, where most of our courses start. Um, we love it because it's super easy to get to, dead easy, friendly climbing, there's some harder challenges in it, and a fantastic aspect. Hi, I'm Chris. And I'm Vicky from Anyone Can. And um, we're just finishing off our recce of uh, climbing in Spain for people with a range of needs and abilities. So we're climbing on the Costa Blanca currently and we've been to a whole variety of climbing crags. All of them have less than a five minute walk in. The paths are fairly flat and straightforward, not too technical. The climbs at every crag have got everything from easy for kind of people just getting into climbing and building up their confidence to much harder and steeper climbs for those that want to take their climbing further. So one of the reasons we, we uh, chose Spain as a, our, our venue for climbing in the winter season is that the temperature here is perfect, the rock tends to be very dry, it's very unlikely that it's going to rain, uh, but it's also got a sport climbing tradition, so the rock already has protection added to it, uh, which makes it very efficient to climb. We can do lots of different climbing in different styles uh, and have brilliant days of, of lots of contact with the rock and very little faff. Other reasons we love it out here is it's next to the Mediterranean so there's opportunities for post-climbing swims or ice creams and there's lots of nice Spanish villages for a beer in the evenings. It's beautiful climate, it's really stunning scenery and um, the accommodation out here is really comfortable and people are super friendly. We've got two accommodations that we've looked at. We've got a four-star hotel in Benidorm and we've got a bunkhouse up in the mountains which is run by climbers, four climbers. Hi, apologies for the uh, disembodied voice. We learned a few lessons while we're away about managing the audio and we lost a little section in the process. What we're trying to say is where our accommodation is, it's a beautiful old town with access to shops, restaurants and pharmacy uh, within walking distance of the actual town and the accommodation. Our first open trip is November 2020 and it's based from that orange guest house in the pictures. Back to the video. Uh, we also run private courses where um, four or more people get together and get their own dates. Generally in the spring or the autumn when the weather here is great. Um, we look forward to seeing you. And if you're worried about whether you would be able to come along with a given disability, please give us a call and chat us through with it and we can give you some advice. So we've just had our post-climb paddle because it was a little bit chilly for a swim and now we're enjoying the evening with a nice beer and there's an ice cream and crepe to come. Hopefully see you in 2020. See you in 2020. Harbour's do something stupid in the background, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> 